So Thanksgiving is apparently one of the biggest binge eating days of the year. I think I've seen anywhere estimates from 5,000 to 10,000 calories that the average American consumes. Now, no doubt tonight, somebody's going to be envious that their cousin, their uh, uncle can seem to eat whatever they want and, and not seem to gain weight. I got to point something out, though. If you had any other condition that required you to do anything else other than eat, right? If you needed to take medications, you have a disability that requires house modifications or uh, limits you to where you could live because you need extra space. I think most people would recognize that's not a benefit in life. That's a liability. And yet when it comes to eating, for some reason, a fast metabolism that requires us to eat 3,000 calories, 4,000 just to stay alive. Some people seem to think that's an asset for, for some bizarre reason, right? Um, I've traveled around the world in Taiwan, in Japan, in Poland. They don't seem to be confused about that. When they have a holiday, it doesn't revolve around food. They have cultural arts. And yes, people do eat at celebrations, but the whole celebration doesn't center around food. Only in the United States do we have the luxury of doing that. And we've gotten so confused by it. Now, um, I was working at a tutoring center last year, and um, one of the kids, I think a six, seven-year-old, had asked me what kind of superpower I would want to have. I think it was around the time of Halloween, and so uh, the idea of superpowers came up. And at the table, there was a teenage girl, maybe 15 years old. She was like, oh, I know, I know. I wish I could eat whatever I want and not get fat. And I commented uh, to the kids, I kind of want the opposite. I wish I didn't have to eat and wouldn't die. And the reason for that is because it would free up a lot of time. Time I could be spending tutoring you guys. And it would free up a lot of mental energy. If I wanted to take a trip, I wouldn't have to think about uh, where do I stop for food, right? Uh, road trips would be easier, uh, flights would be easier to, to deal with, work schedules could be a lot easier, and I would save a lot of money that I could then use to further my education in order to tutor you guys, right? Every year I go to a computer gaming conference, I'd, I'd have more money to do that. And so um, everybody had a puzzled look on their face, but that's the truth. If I could press a button and never have to eat anything again, I'd do it. Um, but unfortunately, in the United States, we've become badly confused about what food is, right? It's a liability that we have to eat, right? A lot of people don't seem to realize that, right?